A special thank you to each of our subscribers who make this channel possible. Here's today's story. Four people were injured after a bus carrying the Abilene Christian football team was involved in a crash with another vehicle in Lubbock, Texas on Saturday night. One player, two coaches, and the bus driver were taken to University Center in Lubbock for minor injuries, according to a statement by the ACU Athletics Department. The Lubbock Police Department told multiple news outlets that a 19-year-old driver collided with the bus, was charged with DWI, and taken into custody. The team was returning home to Abilene after a close game against the Texas Tech Red Raiders at the Jones AT&T Stadium when the collision occurred. Video posted to social media shows a white truck with extensive front-end damage at the scene. We are grateful to Texas Tech Director of Athletics Kirby Hocutt, their team physician, Dr. Michael Phy, and all of the first responders for their assistance and care, the ACU statement said. Abilene Christian, an FCS school, lost 52-51 to in overtime to the Red Raiders. The Wildcats outscored Texas Tech 17-6 in the fourth quarter to tie the game at 45. After both teams scored a touchdown in overtime, Abilene Christian's attempt at a two-point conversion that would have given the Wildcats a victory failed. A bus carrying members of the Abilene Christian football team was hit by an intoxicated driver on Saturday night, which left four on the bus injured. Two coaches, a player, and the driver of the bus were all transported to a hospital with minor injuries in Lubbock, Texas, after their game against Texas Tech. The team was returning home to Abilene after a close game against the Texas Tech Red Raiders at Jones AT&T Stadium when the collision occurred. Video posted to social media showed a white truck with extensive front-end damage at the scene. A 19-year-old driver collided with the bus and was charged with driving while intoxicated, Lubbock police said. We are grateful to Texas Tech Director of Athletics Kirby Hocutt, their team physician, Dr. Michael Phy, and all of the first responders for their assistance and care, the ACU statement said. The Red Raiders were 31.5-point favorites. However, the game went into overtime where Texas Tech squeaked out a 52-51 victory. Texas Tech led by 18 at one point, and even by 11 at the beginning of the fourth quarter, but the Wildcats scored a touchdown with 4.55 to go to tie it at 42. After the Red Raiders kicked a field goal, Abilene Christian matched it as time expired in regulation. The Red Raiders got the ball first in overtime, scoring a touchdown and knocking down the extra point. Abilene Christian returned with a touchdown of their own, but their two-point conversion for the win was unsuccessful. An alleged drunk driver and the Abilene Christian football team's bus were involved in a crash late Saturday night that left four people injured. One football player, two coaches, and the bus driver suffered minor injuries at the scene of an intersection in Texas and were transported to a local hospital. Parker Young, 19, was arrested and charged with DWI after he disregarded traffic directions and collided with the bus. The bus was at the start of its approximately 170-mile journey from Abilene Christian's game against Texas Tech in Lubbock back to campus when the accident occurred. Photos and video posted on Twitter showed a white truck with extensive front-end damage at the scene. Texas Tech outlasted Abilene Christian, 52-51, in overtime by stopping a two-conversion attempt that would have clinched the upset for the FCS program had it succeeded. Abilene Christian never led in the game, but rallied from an 18-point second-quarter deficit and tied the score with five seconds remaining in regulation. That's all for this story. We upload videos every day covering many different subjects, so hit that subscribe button to stay informed. Thanks for watching.